zero for pain. And the other girls are really. That's what she told you. Hey, hey, that's why I used to do, you know? Yeah. So, and you know, really, it's feeling for Fahima. Yeah. And I've got it here. And Z, I've got it here. So I've got them both like. Because <laughs> they know that I could, you know. Facts. And I'm enjoying that position. I'm going to stay there. Yeah. The best thing I can do is just make her present so great that she forgets the future. <laughs> Guys, permit me to laugh. Since I've been watching Big Brother show, I have never seen a bad boy like Sinai. What? <laughs> this guy's gameplay and strategy of being a bad boy is something else. Like I said in my previous video, you know, Sinaye and... I said in my previous video that Sinaye and Fayema spend literally their time together at the party yesterday. And after the party, they spent some time together before Ina went to Z and spent the rest of the night. Okay? So, guys, Sinaye has revealed his plan. He said his plan is working for him. His plan is to make sure that these two girls are not happy with each other. Okay? And he feels he has both of them on the choke mode. Because from what he was saying, he said Z was complaining about Fahima's attitude and all of that. So, Sinaye is so happy that Z and Fahima seem not to be in good terms because of him. Can you imagine? <laughs> Sinaye, Sinaye, Sinaye is so happy that Z seems to not like Fahima because of how he's moving towards Fahima. And the joy, the gladness in Sinaye's face is something else. He said he's enjoying it. He's going to keep things moving like that. Really enjoying everything that is going on between the both ladies. He's going to stay there. He's not going to stop. He will keep putting pressure on Fahima and doing the same thing to Z and all of that. I'm like, Sinaye, <laughs> these girls are smart. <laughs> like, the Z I'm seeing can see through Sinaye so much. He knows what Sinaye is doing and she's just moving with the flow. Because Sinaye, because Z has said it plenty times that she feels and she knows that Sinaye wants to use her to play his game. And she knows it already. So in my head, I'm like, Sinaye, if you know what you are up to, you look at just stop already. Because one, Z can see through you. He knows what you, she knows what you are doing. And Fahima, on the other hand, she's so inconsistent. She's a disruptor. She's on a mission. Okay, today you see her with Willie. Next tomorrow you see her with Mac Junior. Like she's ahead of you. <laughs> and the one that now busts my bubble is when Sinai said, the "Best thing I can do is just make her present so great that she forgets the future, bro. Mm. And make it amazing that she's like." She starts to forget about the future. Sinai said he's planning on, you know, requesting a flower for Z. And also, he's going to get somebody to cook. We all know Valentine is coming very soon. So, he's doing everything possible to, like, make Z not to doubt his intentions towards her. Sinai said he's going to make this present so good, so lovely, so adorable that she's going to forget her future. I'm like, yo, hey, the gamer is about to be gamed. <laughs> and the most funny part is Taki. Taki is just nodding in accordance. He's not even trying to like discourage him or trying to tell him that, oh, your plan is bad. He was just nodding and accepting and concurring everything Sinai was saying. Taki is such a bad, <laughs> he's such a bad disruptor. He knows that Sinai's plans are actually bad, but he keeps encouraging him. <laughs> oh my God. <clears throat> Sinai is not a bad boy at all, at all. Oof, he's not. Because if he's really a bad boy, he will make all these moves without saying it out. That is why, somehow, I prefer Jared's game. Because Jared is playing the bad boy game. And he's 
has taken it with his full chest. But Sina he keeps saying and saying and saying things without even making, <laughs> without even doing anything serious. So Sina he is saying that he's really happy that Faima and Z seem to not like each other and he's really enjoying it. But guys, so come to think of it, how will Z forget her future in that house? Z is super aware that Sinaye is engrossed with his girlfriend. She's super aware of that. I don't think Z is ready to put herself in that, you know, situation. <laughs> it's funny how <laughs> Sinaye thinks if he keeps showing Z's love, if he keeps doing really nice things, Z will forget the fact that Sinai has a girlfriend and she will just fall yakata. I didn't make a move to touch you in any way. I really am sorry. I, was, I, I don't see you as loose or easy or anything like that. Away from that, if you've been listening for some days now, Elsa has been complaining that Papa Ghost wanted to you know, take advantage of her after the Thursday pool party. Else and Papa Ghost were on the bed together having conversations, you know. And later, Else started saying that she felt disrespected that Ghost were trying to, like, you know, take advantage of her and she felt really cheap and stuff like that. So they had their conversation and Papa Ghost apologized and said, no, it will never make her feel that type of way. But to be honest, that night, Else was moving. A certain way you know she was being off letitious and you know trying to do as if she wanted to kiss ghosts so i think ghost just moved with the flow but at the end of the day she said she felt disrespected that ghost wanted to torture her in you know in a disrespectful way and all of that so papa ghost already apologized to her Osha moments of the week definitely has to be liama she wins she absolutely wins. She uh, no. couldn't keep it in, you know? Just decided to spread it all around. Jareed, Mosha moments, bro. Really, you just gonna kiss her right in front of You incited that. Ooh, young puppy. Young puppy's out here, eh? I don't know if he's being tactical, conniving, scheming, or he's just a young boy who doesn't get it really you know he kisses here and then he talks badly then he comes back for another cuddles a mosha moment again that was really really nice you know because people were worried how can these disruptors what do they do ducky nice one bro coming through just spreading a little room and watching it catch fire and i also love how you just like step back afterwards and like yeah and they did all right ducky nicely done you're finally doing disruptor work uh, fahima you need to step it up a notch, eh? Yeah, you can't just mosh out one person, Mac Jr., and then think your job is done. No, there's other housemates, and now I see what you're trying to do. Nah, everybody else was pretty chill. I think everybody else is just hopping on the jar, reading the M, I think. Yeah, but those are the mosh out moments.